Hey, what's up, world? Bad Boy Fan 1422 here today with Naruto Manga Chapter Review of uh, I-73. And so we start off with Toby looking at Naruto and questioning what names. Who are you talking about? And Naruto looks at Toby's like, Ha, you don't even know their names. And if you didn't know, he actually did stick his tongue out, which I thought was pretty funny, which humored my day in the morning. <laughs> And so Toby is about to grab his staff, which I don't know what what is that staff made of or what is it used for? What do you think? So anyway, as he's grabbing it, he noticed water is dripping out from his gloves, and he's thinking, "Sweat? <laughs> I'm sweating because of Naruto? Hell no!" And he's like, "Oh, it's just rain, huh? Thank God. Why the hell would I sweat over fighting Naruto? He's just some." Someone to fuel Sasuke's, Sasuke's rage and anger. <laughs> he's nothing else and he's nothing more. He's only serving two purposes. Sasuke's rage and giving me the Nine Tails power. Huh. But I must imagine, why wouldn't his hands sweat? I mean, they're in these gloves all this time. In his gloves all this time. Why wouldn't they sweat? <laughs> anyway. So then we go back to the HQ, and Chukaku is um, asking, or sorry, no. Chukaku is informed by Al that Naruto and B and Gaigakushi are still fighting Toby, but they managed to seal away the other Jinshuriki. And so Shikaku tells Inoichi to send a message to all the reinforcements going to Naruto's position. And that he wants Inoichi to up everyone's morale. And so Inoichi gives a speech telling them that, you know, Naruto, B, Gai, and Kaji are doing all they can to keep the front lines to protect you guys from Tobi and the other Jinchurigi that might have come out and slaughtered you all. So get there, help them as best as you can, and victory will be assured. And then after that, Inoichi's nose starts to bleed from the amount of chakra he had to use to contact every single person in the Shino Shinobi army. Which I thought was like, damn. So anyway, then we see all the Shinobi running towards Naruto's position. First we see Hinata, and she's in her mind, she's thinking, um, you know, I was chasing you, Naruto, but not anymore. At the end of this war, I'm going to be with you, I'm going to hold your hand with you, and I'm going to be with you. Just wait for me. And I thought, aww. Because I'm serious, this is a chick who really loves Naruto and wants to be with him. But as we know, Naruto is, a, <laughs> is an idiot, and it takes him a while to process things through his head. Although... Even though she does say this, we're still not sure about Naruto's feelings towards Hinata. I mean, he might like her, he might even love her, but we don't know that because Kishi's never uh, filled in that gap, filled in the gap between them. And so it goes to Kiba, and he's thinking of Naruto, and he's uh, and he thinks to himself, "You know, Naruto, I'm gonna make you my rival. You are now my rival since we were kids." And to me, I'm thinking. Uh, if Kiba and Naruto become rivals, I would I would imagine them being like Kakashi and Guy in a way. I can imagine Naruto being like Guy and uh, Kiba being like Kakashi in a way. <laughs> and I just thought that'd be more funny because a lot of people say that you know Naruto and Sasuke are gonna be that eternal rival between Guy and Kakashi, but I'm thinking eh, I kind of like Naruto and Kiba better. It'd be more fun because you know they're both animals. You know Naruto with his fox, Kiba with his dog. Or wolf, wolf, whichever one. I thought that was better. So anyway, and then it goes to Shino, and he thinks to himself, uh, "I'm gonna help Naruto, and I'm going to use all my buzz and my ninja to to help him." And you know what? I don't need a reason why. I'm just gonna do it. And then it goes to Ten Ten, and she's thinking, "Oh, I hope Guy Sensei is fine, and Naruto." Will we be? Will we make it in time, or will we be too late? I'm pretty sure what she thinks. I really didn't pay attention to that part. Mm. Anyway, then it goes to uh, Shikamaru, Choji, and Ino. Uh, Ino kind of 
like thinks in her head about her father she says thank you because now we all feel how naruto feels and that's going to help us help him to fight off toby because we'll have the power of friendship and our bonds and the strength of our bonds to help us and then choji thinks like in the past him and naruto were labeled as well not as the same but both were labeled as worthless and you know naruto was labeled as the stupid idiot and choji is the fat idiot and he says and he thinks that you know over time we've changed the way people see us you know naruto is not as stupid as he used to be and i'm not as worthless as i used to be and so he says just wait for me naruto the the slim choji is on the way which i thought was pretty funny and then shikamaru was singing the said you know, Naruto is just an idiot. He's just going to run into battle and not even think of a strategy. So that's why I'm going. I'm the strategizer. I'm here to help out. And then Sai is thinking in his head. Oh, wow. This, so this is what it truly means to have friends. I think I understand now. Thanks to you, Naruto. And so it goes to uh, uh, Lee, who's thinking about Naruto and Guy Sensei. And he's like, and he's like, I'm ready to go, I'm ready to fight, I'm ready to protect the village with protect Naruto and Guy Sensei. And then last but not least, Sakura, who is running along with them, and she thinks in her she's thinking, you know, Naruto, don't worry. You, this time you won't be alone. We're all going in this together. We will all fight with you, and you won't have to be alone. Which I thought was pretty like uh, crucial because if in every single fight Naruto's had with some powerful character, he's always done it alone, in a way, without any other help. So, this is crucial because now he won't be alone. He'll have his friends there. He'll have the village, his village. He'll have the other villages behind his back. And, you know, he won't be alone. And so, you see the footsteps of the shinobi that ran through. You got a panel where the footsteps of the shinobi that ran through, you just see their footsteps and the rain covering that. Then you got a next page. It's the same thing, except you only see one track of footsteps, and we see that it's Sasuke. And that turn he does and that glare just symbolizes that, you know, he's getting impatient. Well, he's not getting impatient, but he's just getting really, like, psyched up and ready to go. Like, that glare is the glare of death in his eyes which he will probably give to Naruto and anyone else who stands in his way. And so, uh, there's some questions and concerns, like, um, well, I have a question. What do you think is happening between Madara and the five Kages? Because we don't really see what happens anymore with them. Uh, question two, or concern, is that people saying Jirai will be revived and used in the battle? To me, I'm not sure if he might be, if Kabuto might revive Jirai, even though he says he can't, he probably can. And so, because uh, I heard this one thing, or I saw a comment on a video that said, you know, Kabuto was able to revive Deidara, and he blew himself up. He nuked his own body to where there was nothing left. How was he able to revive Deidara and not be able to revive Jiraiya? And to me, I was saying, yeah, hey, that's pretty true, you know. If he can revive Deidara, why can't he revive uh, Jiraiya? And so, uh, what do you think? What are your thoughts? And, uh, you know, like the video, comment. I could really use some comments, you know, just to let you know. Just to let your viewers out there, let you know that I'm really, like, into this. I want to hear your comments. I want to see your questions and concerns. If you have any questions, ask me, or if you want me, want me to make a video of what I think, of what your questions are, just, you can do that. I wouldn't mind doing it. I enjoy this. So, you know, comment, subscribe, like, anything you want. It doesn't, you don't have to, but I'm just asking if you can. That would be great. Thank you, and bye-bye.